Hi, this is Sipu David, the Mind and Body Mentor. We're going to start a new series on training you how to expand your mind, training you how to get a stronger mind and stronger internal force. So, so far we've been teaching you how to defend yourself, how to get stronger, how to punch harder. Those are all external and those are all very important. But once you have a good foundation and you have a strong body, then what is the next step? Well, the next step is to train your mind because the mind is way more powerful than the body. Eventually, your body will wither away. Eventually, you will get old and eventually you will not have the strength and you will not have the uh, abilities that you have when you're young. So when you are growing older, you're going to need to use other things that come from the, your internal power, internal forces, rather than your external forces. So we're going to teach you exactly how to do that. You probably have a lot of questions about how all that works, but that's what I'm here for. And that's what this new series is going to be talking about. So one of the interesting topics that we're going to cover in this series is we're going to talk about the ancient sacred texts from ancient spiritual religions or beliefs and how that, how, what they teach us about our body, what they teach us about our mind, our heart and our spirit. And I'm going to connect it with modern day science discoveries that we have recently made about quantum physics, about uh, how the body works, how the mind works, brain waves, and your electric magnetic, magnetic field in your body. What we are discovering very recently, very exciting, is how that connects to a lot of the ancient um, teachings. And now we're finding out with science that they are actually the same thing. So we're going to talk about that, how the spiritual side of beliefs will connect with science. And I know a lot of you will not believe it, but that's okay. You don't need to watch this channel. You can watch somebody else's channel. Um, if you're really interested in learning about how spirituality connects with science, that's some topic that I've been really researching into the last few years. And I've discovered a lot of really cool things that I've been able to test on myself, test with my friends, and a lot of them work. A lot of it doesn't work, but then I found things that really do work when it comes to technology and science and spirituality. So that's where we're gonna go with this channel. 